Hello everybody and welcome to Truth Well Told Tarot. This is Andrea and I'm here to do your weekend tarot reading. And it will be from the 16th, Saturday the 16th to Sunday the 17th of October 2021. Remember, these are mini tarot readings where we look at the potential of the energies that are around you for the next few days. The readings can resonate a few days longer than when they're released and it won't resonate with everybody and that's fine. So just take what resonates with you. The good news is Mercury retrograde is coming to an end in the next few days. So I don't know about you, certainly can't wait to see the back of it. I did a daily reading yesterday. It taped perfectly, apart from no sound. <laughs> so yeah, can't come soon enough for me as a reader. Anyway, let's get straight into these readings. Gemini, let's see what we have for you. This is for Gemini Sun, Moon Rising and Venus. Message for our lovely Geminis, thank you. This is the Druid Tarot deck for those of you who are interested. Message for Gemini, thank you. Okay, Gemini. So we start with the Nine of Cups. What's a nice card to start with? <laughs> We have Rebirth. So this is the Judgment card. It's coming in the form of some kind of Rebirth. So some kind of awakening energy here. And it's right next to the Nine of Cups, which is beautiful. It's a wish coming true, the Nine of Cups. Five of Swords. And the Eight of Cups, yeah. Gemini, the Five of Swords, air energy, so it is your energy. Can be a situation of conflict, sometimes a winning at any cost energy where somebody does something that's disrespectful and may even put you at a disadvantage. So their actions may affect you in some way and unfairly so. I'm feeling in this energy, you might be, I mean, this can be obviously in a work environment, this could be in a home or friendship or relationship, whatever the situation is. The Eight of Cups is an energy of walking away, walking away because you don't want this anymore. Somebody is walking away, either because of what this represented or because you want to remove yourself from a situation of conflict or something that is negative and disruptive in your life. This is an energy of somebody moving on, somebody who feels it's time, they're ready, they're empowered, they wear the red. They're trusting their intuition and their instincts are saying it's time to go somewhere and the Eight of Cups walks towards the Nine of Cups, towards greater happiness, joy, reasons to celebrate, reasons to be thankful, wish coming true. I feel in this energy, Gemini, somebody is taking matters in hand. So whatever this situation is, someone's turning their back on it because it just doesn't serve their highest good anymore. And they, this is an energy of walking away from something that hasn't worked out or walking away from disappointment in some way towards something better and the energy is you are because there is rebirth for some of you the rebirth feels quite imminent because these cards are in the reading it feels like it might well come in suddenly sometimes to do with decisions and choices the rebirth card but because it's called a rebirth it feels spirit is telling you your rebirth is assured and it's karmically assured because I feel somebody, I feel the universe is bringing in some karmic reward. And the universe can work through people. So it might well be things happen, synchronic synchronicities are happening. Um, it's all part of awakening. You releasing what's gone and opening up to stepping into your wish, your hope, your dream here. Achieving your wish, your hope, your dream. There may well be something coming in and coming in very quickly, very suddenly, um, that is requiring you to act. But it feels very positive. The Nine of Cups is your heart's desire in love. 
in terms of other areas, it's a, it's a wish. It's getting exactly what you want. It's a wish coming true. This just feels beautiful. It's walking away from something that hasn't served, has, has run its course for whatever reason, to something better. And there's karma on your side with this energy. Bringing in some kind of positive wish being granted. Absolutely beautiful, Gemini. I feel that there may well be like some sudden call to action. Final message for Gemini, please. Final message for Gemini, thank you. Yeah, we have Swan. Graceful transformation, soften your heart and find your flow. I mean, this person is being led by heart energy, cups energy here as well. You know, that intuition. Honeybee, divine feminine, you are being called on to rise. Isn't that beautiful? Graceful transformation and rise. Uh, this rising energy and you're going from the eight to the nine is what I'm definitely sensing here. Just feels all part of your rebirth. I hope you enjoyed the reading. If you did, please do like, share and subscribe and I will see you next time. Thank you.